My name is Gray and I'm a girl and that's the show. Microgravity detected. I'm told my ops are hidden as an HR expense in the Transstar books. It's true. I do solve people problems. Your workmates hiding in the cargo bay are going to suffocate in a few minutes. Maybe you can um, save rude. Them, but you'll have to come out of the walls, rat. Life support. The clock is ticking. <sighs> Morgan. Dal's cut off oxygen. There's nothing I can do from here, and none of the doors are responding. Atmosphere controls are in life support. If you can help, do it quick. Or this is the last time we'll be talking. I I want to help. Which way is life support? Assessment is mistaken. Dahl is manipulating the oxygen and nitrogen mixture. With nitrogen flooding into the atmosphere, anyone in the cargo bay will asphyxiate far more quickly than had he simply cut the oxygen. I suspect they'd already be dead if Dahl weren't trying to use them to manipulate you. Okay, but like, I want to help them. Oh my god. Ah. I need to go to life support? What's the fastest way to life support? Okay. I am going to try um killing it. Uh killing the killing the tech officer. That's fine. Cool, I'm going a different place now. Ah! Ah. Hi, you're friendly. I like that. Okay, going back to where? Conflicted and shiz. I mean, if there's a way to genuinely get rid of the entire threat, then like people could live. But I feel like that's not gonna be a thing. Oh god, that's a lot of coral. Whew. Yes. 
Whew. Ah, Morgan really just wants a vacation. Just wants to sit back on a beach that is an actual beach. Unlike a chair, that's a real chair. Drink a drinky drink. That isn't actually secretly a mimic. Or anything trying to murder her. That would be delightful. I would love it if there was more, uh, not murder. <laughs> more not murder, please. Not less murder. No, 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 no. More not murder. God, this is so stressful. I also really need to rethink my setup because the position I'm in right now is hilariously horrible for my body. My chiropractor would be so mad. Okay, back up. All personnel must complete monthly physicals during their stay aboard Talos 1. Dr. DeVries promises to make them as quick and painless as possible. Morgan, I don't believe always you. always breathing down my neck. I don't know how much longer. Shit. Wait, what? transport with the medical operator. Then we can see about removing his neuromod and hopefully gaining his shuttle in the process. You never cease to impress me, Morgan. I'm coming out now. So much easier than I thought. I promised you my arming cape. All I ask is you hear me out first. And you can blow Talos 1 to pieces if that's what you think is best. I don't think you'll do it. I know. <laughs> because I used to think we couldn't be trusted to play with fire without burning the house down. But you convinced me. You showed me anything was possible, even if the price was steep. That part of you is still in there. We can make history, Morgan. Not those leeches on the Transtar board of directors, not mom and dad. You and I. Just like we planned. We got the data to confirm what you suspected. And Carl is broadcasting a neural signal. A secret message reaching to the stars. What I want to know is what is the message? And who is listening to it? I think you know. Ever since we first tested the Typhon Neuromods, you've known. This fabrication plan is for the Null Wave device prototype you can see. It will hijack the coral signal and use it to deliver a massive shock to every Typhon organism at once. Take it. And the army key, like I pro- What? Morgan! Ah! No! Oh no! 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 Oh! Oh no! Ah!
Okay. You'll need to get down to the nearest clinic. Once that's done, I'll arrange transport with the medical operator. Easier said than done. Yeah, wait, what am I? Well, here we are. Hopefully you'll never have to listen to this recording, but if you do, then something unfortunate's happened to me. I suspect you've seen enough by now to abandon the notion of destroying Talos One. I've always been the one who thought we couldn't be trusted uh. to play with fire without burning the house down. But you convinced me that we could do anything we imagined. No matter how ridiculous. I hope you still believe that. If not, then I'm glad I died before seeing my sister succumb to pessimism. We have the data to confirm what you suspected. The coral is broadcasting a neural signal. A secret message reaching out to the stars. What I want to know is what is the message? And who is listening to it? I have a feeling you already know. I'm carrying a fabrication plan for the prototype null wave device you can see. Make one, then place it at the heart of the coral. We will hijack the coral signal and use it to deliver a massive shock to every Typhon organism at once. Good luck, Morgan. I just regret. I won't be at your side to see it happen. Okay, okay. You, I don't like. Oh, wait. What am I choosing to do? <sighs> I'm gonna do this. So, where do I do that? I could go... Yeah, because I could go into my office, right? Without Dahl, we have no chance of getting off the station. We're trapped here. What? Look, I'm sorry, Igwe. I just... his body straight up disappeared. Morgan, you anticipated the kind of appeal Alex would make. Sibling bonds, history. You programmed me to refute him point by point. However, we can skip that. A Typhon the size of a skyscraper is currently eating Talos One for lunch. Ergo, Alex is wrong. Destroy the station, just as you planned. The blast will take the monster down with it. Destroy the station? But... Didn't you hear him? The null way. Alex is correct. It could work. And preserve what we have learned here. We have to try. Igwe, look at the alien outside the station. Of course it's a risk. But we've seen the generator work. To destroy all this. To murder a species. And the research. Lost. It's... Oh. You were right, Morgan. We can't let these things get back to Earth. Even if one of them hit Earth's side. Morgan, please. Morgan. Destroying the station should be the last option, not the first. I don't think they will. That creature is still trying to consume the station. 
and I've picked up multiple hull breaches. I believe in you, Morgan. Make this count. Oh, frickin' fricker frick. Well, here we are. Hopefully you'll never have to listen to this recording, but if you do, then something unfortunate's happened to me. I suspect you've seen enough by now to abandon the notion of destroying Talos One. I've always been the one who thought we couldn't be trusted to play with fire without burning the house down. But you convinced me that we could do anything we imagined. No matter how ridiculous. I hope you still believe that. If not, then I'm glad I died before seeing my sister's... The heart of the Carl is in psychotronics. In the original containment cylinder. I haven't had much success Placing in an all-wave device there. Plans. We'll override the entire coral network with our own signal. Chipset I've been tinkering. Use your psychoscope to locate the, the exact spot. Useful. Well, here we are. Oh my so god, I don't care about your saying you I've do, heard it so many times. Ah! Unfortunate's happened to me. That's fine. I suspect you've um, seen enough by now to abandon the ooh, notion of destroying that's Talos right. One. Okay. I've always been the one who thought we couldn't be trusted to play with fire without burning the house down. But you can fix See, me you make me in imagine. this thing. No matter how ridiculous. Oh. I hope you still believe that. If not, then I'm glad I died before seeing my sister succumb to pessimism. We have the data to confirm what you suspected. The coral is broadcasting a neural signal. A secret message yeah, reaching yeah, yeah. out to the stars. What I want to know I, is what is the message? I don't know. And who is listening to it? I have a feeling you already know. I'm carrying a fabrication See, I want to try the, the psychotronics. No and then, like, Make if it one. doesn't work... Then place it in the heart of the coral. Uh, the coral ah! Ow! Shock that hurt. Typhon organism at once. Good luck, Morgan. I just regret... This is psychotronics, right? Be at your side to see it happen. Right, wait. I want to make sure I'm going in the right way. Yes, okay. Um, yeah. I feel like what would make sense would be to try to blow it all up and then, uh, debate just blowing the ship up. I feel like We've changed so much because at first I was like, blow it up, blow it up. <laughs> but now I don't know. I don't know. I I don't trust anyone. I want to see if this works, but I don't want us to dock until we know that like every single thing is dead. And like uh, the continuation of science. Absolutely not. No, not when you encounter something like this. But I do think it would be worthwhile to know who are they talking to? Because if there are more things coming, it would be good to get rid of that that threat. You know, that's a that would be a big threat. So I think destroy the aliens, do a big sweep, maybe get all of the survivors to one space and do a clean sweep of that in one escape pod, and then blow up the ship. That's what I would do. If the idea hasn't occurred to you, I'm sure it will eventually. Don't do it. I can't predict what would happen if you scan the apex, but all my models point to suffering. Is that where I'm- okay, wait, where am I- where am I going? Yep. Why is it through a bath- gosh dang it! I do the exact same thing every time!
I don't think that we deserve to really make it out. I think that what they're trying to do here is wrong. Oh my god. But I also think that just automatically killing everyone without having a chance to see if anyone can be saved is wrong. We just need time to be able to go through stuff and destroy most of this place. Run, 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 run. I don't know. Oh, that's right. It's... I, I want it to die. See, I don't want to save the thing because of science. I really, really don't. I think that that's a dumb cop-out. I do think that killing innocent people when they don't necessarily have to die is bad. I just hope I'm making the right choice. Obviously, the game will dictate certain things. But we'll see. Microgravity detected. Oh, that's right. Yeah, wait, where am I going? Side one. No! Bad touch! Ah! 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 Oh, come on! Don't get stuck here! Vital signs critical. Yeah, I know! Oof. This is not good!
What the hell have you done? I've simply acted on Morgan's order. Morgan. Your operators locked me out of the con terminal. Good evening, Tom. We need to link up to the null wave device if we're gonna get that signal off before it's too late. Consider the risk. Alex's plan, if it works, is only a short-term solution. None of us has the right to endanger every life on Earth. If anyone's playing God here, it's you. Your lunatic plan denies everyone a birthright to the stars. You know how neuromods are made. The demand will only increase. In the future, Alex envisions, many will die for the benefit of a privileged few. I'm not arguing with a glorified desktop. Kill it, Morgan. Sorry, Morgan. I won't relinquish control of the terminal. You'll have to destroy me. Which means you'll be destroying yourself. Fine. I'll do it myself. Ah. I'm sorry, Morgan. I didn't want to harm your brother. The directives you gave me require I do everything in my power to ensure you destroy Talos One. Did you get rid of the, the photo? Detonating the station safeguards the Earth and perhaps provides a small measure of reparation. I won't relinquish control of the terminal. If you want to activate the null wave, you'll have to kill me. Oh God, I uh, I'm gonna take that ammo. I. I'm so torn because the computer is right. Soon the Apex Typhon will have invaded every quarter of Talos 1. Decide. God, you're so right, though. You're so, so freaking right. <sighs> oh, but I, I don't. Oh. I'm going to save. And I'm gonna. Oh, God. Oh, I hate this. I love you. Uh. Oh, God. a neuromod? Well, it's both an easy answer and a complicated one at the same time. It is the future, today. And more importantly, our past, today. This is the work Transtar does, every employee working together. It's immortality, and it is beautiful. No, you're doing all the bad things. I mean, it was a great game. Really good writing. Really, really well done. Very well crafted. Much more expansive than I ever had given it credit for um, before actually popping the disc in. I just, uh, I hate that those are the two options. I'm definitely, definitely, definitely gonna go back and blow up this whole thing. Ah. Yeah, that's an issue. Oh, was this... is this in the past? I 
remember if there was a corpse there. that he's creepy. It's just like he's so big. Which, I mean, yeah, that's well done. Good job. But it makes it severely unpleasant to encounter. <laughs> Which means mission accomplished. Good job. I wonder if it's time to beat the mind game. I just, I wish that, <laughs> I just wish that it wasn't always like either completely destroy all the things or save everything because of science. Like can't there just be something that's kind of in between where we're trying not to die but then you like actually get rid of all of the aliens? Like, why are you always having to weaponize it and study it and keep it for the advancements of humanity? It's like, no, this is a threat. Please eliminate it. I don't know, that's my... that's my beef. song. in location. Wait, what? I was just gonna reload in order to kill everyone. do activation of the mirror neurons is promising empathy quotient shows to be exceptionally high it probably thinks it was dreaming and nothing mattered you're assuming it thinks like us its life depends on it ours too it all comes down to the choices it made it saved me from the cargo container I would have suffocated otherwise. It's remarkable that it never installed a single Typhon-based neuromod. In my view, this demonstrates a strong identification with us. Michaela. I would have died without my medication. That wasn't easy. That says a lot, I think, about its heart. Can I say that it has a heart? Then, there was a man in psychotronics, Ingram. It let him go. Was that mercy? 
Would you let it live? Yes. Sarah, you're next. The situation in the cargo bay was bad. None of us would have survived without its help. And it destroyed a large number of Typhon across the station. That has to be a good sign. Further, it thwarted Dor's attempt to use us as hostages. If it were one of my officers, I would give it a commendation. Danielle, what do you say? It never saw me, and it never ran into Volunteer 37. Hard to say what it would have done. There were a lot of humans controlled by the Typhon that it could have harmed. Seems like it went out of its way to avoid that. I think it's worth the risk. In the end, it chose to activate the Null Wave device. Why? To preserve the Typhon technology? We can't really know what its motives were for anything it did. But we have to make a choice. You can hear us, can't you? Here. I want to show you something. What you experienced was a reconstruction based on Morgan's memories. This is the world today. We spent years trying to put what you can do into us. We never tried putting what we can do into you. Until now. You're the bridge between our species. I need to know if you see us. I mean, really see us. Take my hand if you do. <laughs> I love that kill them all is an option. We're gonna shake things up like old times. Interesting. Well, thank you so much, everyone, for tuning in. And this was... Oh, so long. So long. I did this in four sessions. Four sit-downs. And two of them were the majority of the time. <laughs> I think, I think... Yesterday? Was it yesterday? No, it was the day before yesterday. The day before yesterday um, was, I think, about ten hours. And today was only... Eight? only about eight so yeah it was a lot but i look forward to kind of exploring and doing all the side stuff this was a very very fun game and also then picking out what to play next i'm thinking that's gonna take a second to figure out um but thank you so much for tuning in bye